Recently, a groundbreaking discovery has shaken the scientific community. A new quasar has been discovered, breaking numerous records and becoming the brightest celestial body ever recorded by humans. The quasar J0529-4351 is so far from Earth that its light takes 12 billion years to reach us. Its energy comes from the fastest growing and hungriest black hole ever observed. This black hole consumes an amount of matter equivalent to the mass of the sun every day. The supermassive black hole at the center of this quasar is estimated to be 17 to 19 billion times larger than the sun each year. It accumulates gas and dust equivalent to 370 suns, making quasar J0529-4351 absurdly bright 500,000 billion times brighter than our sun. J0529-4351 was found in data from four decades ago, but it was so bright that astronomers could not identify it as a quasar. A quasar is a region at the center of a galaxy containing a supermassive black hole surrounded by a ring of dust and gas. The harsh conditions in the accretion disk around the active black hole heat the dust and gas, making it glow brightly. In addition, any matter in this material disk that is not consumed by the black hole is directed to its poles and accelerated to speeds close to the speed of light, forming two huge beams of energy shooting out from the black hole's poles. As a result, a quasar in the active galactic nucleus can be brighter than the light of billions of surrounding stars combined. But even so, J0529-4351 is still extremely prominent. The light of J0529-4351 comes from a huge accretion disk feeding the supermassive black hole. The research team estimates its diameter to be about 7 light years, about 45,000 times the distance between the Earth and the Sun. Initially, J0529-4351 was discovered by the Schmidt Southern Sky Survey Telescope in 1980, but researchers spent decades confirming it as a quasar. Large astronomical surveys provide so much data that researchers need machine learning models to analyze and classify quasars with other celestial bodies. In fact, J0529-4351 is so bright that the models thought it was a star relatively close to Earth. The research team recognized J0529-4351 as a quasar thanks to the use of a 2.3-meter telescope at the Siding Spring Observatory in Australia. Discovery of the Smallest Star and Its Strange Companion A group of astronomers has discovered a peculiar binary star system where the smallest star ever discovered resides. Known as a hot dwarf star, this star is only seven times the size of Earth and smaller than Jupiter, according to researchers from Tsinghua University, Ban Nam Astronomical Observatory, as well as Australia, Europe, and the United States. This small star and its companion, a white dwarf, are about 2,760 light years away from Earth. According to the published research, the hot dwarf star, named at TMTS J0526b, was discovered using the Mahua Ting Survey Telescope of Tsinghua University. Researchers say, the TMTS J0526b has a mass equal to one-third the size of the Sun and burns helium gas at a surface temperature of 2500 Kelvin or 2226.85 degrees Celsius. According to the research, TMTS J0526b and its companion J0526a are too dim to be observed directly, orbiting each other every 20 minutes. Researchers say even though we can't see it with a telescope, we know J0526a exists because of one thing. It is so dense that its gravity has deformed J0526ab from a spherical structure into an egg shape. Such a unique binary star system, including super small, super light stars with extremely short rotation periods, was predicted to exist but has never been discovered before. Now our work provides the first direct observational evidence. According to the report, this discovery supports a theory proposed by Chinese astronomers two decades ago, predicting that small light stars could form through mass exchange in a binary star system. TMTS uses a range of four optical telescopes to continuously search for transient objects in one or two areas of the sky every night. It was built at the Exinglong Observatory near Beijing, China in 2019 with funding from the Mahuateng Foundation and Tsinghua University. 
By 2023, TMTS had obtained photometric data of more than 27 million stars. The research team identified J0526 for further study because it has the fastest changing brightness, making it stand out from the rest. Researchers have confirmed the observations of TMTS with larger telescopes, including the Kekai Telescope in Hawaii and the Gran Telescopio Canarias in the Canary Islands, Spain. The research team hopes that the next generation of gravitational wave detectors in space, which are being built, will be able to detect strange binary star systems. They point out that the system could emit gravitational waves at millihertz frequencies when its component stars orbit each other. Red dwarfs were previously thought to be the smallest among the stars and are also the most common type of star in the Milky Way. According to a 2017 study led by researchers at the University of Cambridge, UK, the smallest red dwarf ever measured is EBLMJ0555-57AB, 600 light years from Earth and only slightly larger than Jupiter. EBLMJ0555-57AB is part of a binary star system as it orbits a larger star. Although quite small compared to other stars, this star still has enough mass to allow nuclear fusion reactions to occur inside the core, transforming hydrogen into helium. Alexander von Boetticher, an astrophysicist at the University of Oxford and a member of the research team said, our discovery shows how small stars can be. If the star EBL MJ05555-57 AB formed with just a slightly smaller mass, then the thermonuclear reaction of hydrogen inside the core could not be sustained, and this star would become a brown dwarf. This star is about 2,000 to 3,000 times dimmer than the Sun. Scientists discovered IBLMJ 0555-57 AB when it moved in front of the larger star it orbits, called EBLMJ 055 57 a According to estimates, the mass of EBLMJ 0555-57 AB is equivalent to the star TRAPPIST-1, discovered in early 2017, but with a radius 30% smaller. Small and dim stars like EBLM J05555-57 AB are considered potential candidates for hosting planets with life as they increase the possibility of retaining liquid water on the surface. Stars smaller than 20% of the Sun are the most common stars in the universe, but there is still much we do not know about them. A dwarf star is a small and very dim type of star. Specifically, dwarf stars are usually smaller in size compared to other stars and often have lower surface temperatures. In the spectral classification of stars, dwarf stars usually belong to types M, K, or C, with M being the type of dwarf star with the lowest surface temperature among these types, 